I'm going to show you a video that proves that the GOP's plan to make America uneducated and ignorant is in fact working. This is Kimberly Galfold, Donald Trump Jr.'s fiance, speaking before Republican delegates at the Republican National Convention, and this is what she had to say. It is no wonder that the heroes who stormed the beaches of Normandy and faced down communism sadly say they don't recognize our country anymore. This is not an accident. Oof. Reminder, Americans during World War II fought fascism and Nazism, not communism. In fact, Russia, a communist superpower, was an American ally during World War II. Now, don't be fooled. Kimmy here knows this very well. But she also knows that the GOP has one plan. Rewrite history. Equating fascism and communism allows the GOP to use the same techniques that were employed by Italy and Germany in the 1930s, without the Republican voters realizing it and pointing at the same time their finger at the opposition. And we all know that the GOP is trying to rewrite history. They're doing so when they minimize the role of America in the business of slavery. They're essentially trying to rewrite history when they tell Americans what they can and can't read. And they're rewriting history when they're trying to convince you that the principle of the separation of church and state isn't a real constitutional principle. And that is exactly what Kimberly Galfall is doing. By telling you that America fought communism during World War II, she's being the mouthpiece for a movement that wants to make America dumber and less educated because an ignorant populace is easier to control.